a messy and I know it. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> Bitch, I'm clutching, I'm clutching my motherfucking pearls, bitch. Oh, it's great to be king. It is great to be king. Queen stands alone for a reason. A queen stands alone for a motherfucking reason. Because, see, a lot of people, from what I'm hearing, over this past weekend, it's been very revealing. It's been very revealing. These past two weeks where I've done, this, where I've done the challenge has been a very revealing past few weeks for me. I've learned a lot. I've discovered a lot. I hope you guys have learned and discovered. I hate the truth. I hope you guys have learned and discovered a lot as well, too. Now, the challenges that I did, they're definitely for fun and for camaraderie. But also, you know, there's a method to my motherfucking madness. I said, let me. I said, let me remove the queen off the chessboard, okay? Let me remove the queen, because you know the queen can move anywhere on the chess piece. But the one move that motherfuckers never expect the queen to make is to sit the fuck down. So I said, you know what? I'm going to sit the fuck down. And as I just threw it out there that I'm going to sit the fuck down, these motherfuckers have been running a motherfucking muck. Their true feelings have been shown. They just in this bitch acting a plum motherfucking fool. Now, some may say that they are doing it because the first challenge that Rita won, I cashed that Rita immediately $100. Hey, D. Ramsey. Um, I also, after I cashed up her $100, Club Chat showed up onto Rita's live and not once, but twice, flooded her. Flooded her with Super Chats, monetary support, onto Rita, who successfully ran these motherfucking streets. You get what I'm saying? Um, Fabe mentioned something in her ponytail challenge, which I found quite interesting. Who that liar that look real inviting? Who that old manipulating liar? Ooh, 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 ooh. Trust. Blue represents loyalty, wisdom, intelligence. Mona, you must. Y'all ain't finna work this ponytail, girl. Y'all ain't finna work this ponytail, girl. Child, I feel like Miss Cleo over here tonight, girl. I feel like Miss Cleo, we is reading, honey. Reading from the ponytail. These hoes ain't ready. This is Mona, the manipulating life coach, girl. Oh, and let me tell you something, Sean Bradley. Ain't no defense for that liar. There is no defense for the liar. Oh, she's all manipulating hag, ain't she, girl? Straight from the A with the lies and the alibis. Heidi, Heidi, you ain't shit, Heidi. You ain't shit, Heidi. You ain't shit. Get a Heidi, because you know what? Guess what? She recorded me too, Heidi. Get a Heidi. Let me tell you something, your old lying life coach. I want you to release the tape you got on me. I want you to. Because unless you lie and chop, chop it and screw it, you're going to know for a fact that everything I said, I stand by. And don't make me spill your tea. Don't make me spill your tea. But don't you ever threaten me to release a tape with your dumb ass. I want you to release a tape. You want me to tell Onside April what you said about her right now? See, I'm over here trying to keep the peace. So I don't put you in your bogus ass wig on blast. But if you play with me, Mona Dollar Sign Cash App, Mona Simone Dollar Sign Cash App, Need a Wheelchair Cash App. If you play with me, I will put you on blast. But I have been over here trying to keep the peace, Mona Simone. She said um, that there are a lot of things that are happening behind the scenes. Well, I know legally, um, for me, there are definitely things happening behind the scenes because it's legal. So, I mean, yeah, it, definitely Sean Bradley is definitely popping behind the scenes, baby. Why wouldn't I be? I'm messy, right? I'm messy. I'm supposed to be. But what I found very fucking interesting when she had mentioned Mona and she mentioned the conversations that Mona had with all these people. And I wrote in the casino. I told y'all this has been a very revealing time. I told y'all this is cleansing season. It's been a very revealing time. And what Five Ape said in her uh, ponytail challenge, I don't know if she really meant to say it, but a messy bitch like me gonna scope it out. A messy bitch like me gonna scope it out, bitch. Okay. <laughs> I mean, shit. I mean, ugh. So what she said was, a lot of things are happening behind the scenes. And then she brought up Mona in it. She brought up Mona in it. And then she goes and says, well, Mona, um, you, we, we talked on the phone and you recorded my conversation. So go ahead and record my conversation. Um, to go, go, go ahead and not record it, but release the conversation. Now, Mona, now, Mona, bitch. 
Now, come on, a bitch. I'm tired of telling you to release the motherfucking audio tapes, girl. I'm tired of... Th these people is coming for your neck, Mona. Release the audio tapes on these motherfuckers. Already, Mona. Now, some of y'all may say that Mona is despicable or deplorable. Mona Samoon is a liar. She's a liar. For recording people without their possibly... Without possibly their permission. However, I'm gonna defend Mona. Okay. Y'all say Mona can't be defended, but you know a bitch like me gonna pull a defense at the crack of my ass. If I can. And I'm gonna give y'all a, I'm gonna give Mona a wonderful, I'm gonna give y'all and Mona a wonderful defense of why you should record these fake phony motherfuckers that may ring your bell on these YouTube streets. Hmm. Think about it. What have we been witnessing ever since I've said, who can run these streets? Edition one, now edition two. These motherfuckers have been running around acting a plum fool, talking out the sides of both of their mouths, doing everything and anything to be noticed. Not by Sean Bradley, but by Club Chat. Because see, Club Chat is a movement. D. Ramsey said betrayal is running rampant in these YouTube streets. Huh, you might be on to something. But see, it's not to be noticed by me. It's to be noticed by Club Chat. Because see, Club Chat has the power. Club Chat is the one that will decide Sean, well, she released one to me, little bro. She did. Oh, she did, April. Oh, bitch, I'm going to have to call you after this. Oh, well, April, get the tea, bitch. You know I ain't going to tell nobody. You know I ain't going to tell nobody, bitch. But anyway, but you know, oh, I'm excited, not you. Oh, I'm really a mess. This type mess. Ooh, the mess never cease. Thanks, Jay Wilson. Um, betrayal is running rampant on these YouTube streets. D. Ramsey said it best. Okay. But Club Chat is a motherfucking movement. You motherfuckers are a movement. We are out here being positive, spreading positivity, and all these motherfuckers can do is run around and stab each other in the back, hate on the next motherfucker. But we are out here on these streets spreading love and positivity, giving back. People are noticing th the generosity of club fucking chat, and these motherfucking haters, these green-eyed motherfucking mon money hungry, are upset about it. Upset about it. We have some strong, independent thinking, sometimes messy but always loving and supporting motherfuckers. And it ain't just a motherfucking word. We put action behind it all the fucking time. And them hoes are hoping and wanting to be noticed by club chat and want to be graced and blessed by motherfucking club chat. But bitch, it ain't for everybody. Everybody can't get a motherfucking seat at the table, bitch. You can't. Because see, we move on compassion and love. We mess it in a motherfucker. But it don't move us. Not the, it don't move us to go in our motherfucking pockets. That's what y'all don't understand. Oh shit, anyway. <laughs> now, um, the reason why if I was a Mona Simone, I would record every conversation that I have with all these messy motherfuckers that are messy and nasty with it, is simply that. You see how all these motherfuckers saying, I was on the phone with Mona Simone. I was on the phone with Mona Simone. I was on the phone with Mona Simone. I was on the phone. I said, ooh, when I was in Five Babes Chat, I said, uh, interesting. All of these people are on the phone with Mona Simone. Yet, Sean Bradley has never been on the phone with Mona Simone. I feel left out. Not. Sean Bradley messy. But you ain't never caught a bitch like me on the phone with a Mona Simone. Ain't nowhere to be found. Nowhere to be found. Ain't nowhere to be found. But all these people somehow been recorded because they on the phone with Mona Simone. Real life happen behind the scenes on these YouTube streets. Okay, real life. I can't make it no simpler than that. Behind the scenes, real life fucking happens. That's all behind the scenes is. It's off of YouTube. It's not in your face. You don't need to know about it. Every time I hear a bitch say, behind the scenes, I say, look at a bitch trying to be messy. Look at a bitch trying to be messy. That's what I hear. That's when a mother say, behind the scenes, look at a bitch trying to be messy. Let me talk about XTSCC. The people that came from TSCC, they have, let me tell you something. Only thing I've witnessed them do 
is bring their activities that they used to do over there, over here. That's all I witnessed. The same shit and activities that they used to do over there. All that doxing and playing them games and behind the scenes and calling folks, calling CPS. They no, they no longer on TSCC. They call themselves being on this side over here. But they doing the same thing. Doing the same thing. Because they got that TSCC in their blood. Once a troll, always a troll. Yeah, I said it. Once a troll, always a troll. And the same shit y'all pulled over there with BS because y'all still love her. And on site April, you said it out your own mouth that you still love her. Mm -hmm. and, and guess what? Let me say this. If y'all think I'm slow, you dumb as hell. Because as much as I accept all and appreciate all the help that on site April has given me, I made sure I gave her $75 for her help. I spills my own tea. I gave her $75 for her help. Because I don't owe anybody anything. But let me tell you something. I'm way smarter than y'all want to give me credit for. Because truth be told, on-site April had a case on her. So you want to help me help yourself? Why you didn't book her? Why you didn't pop her, April? I know why you didn't pop her. Because you still love her. And I get it. Because all of you ex-TSCC members are still trolling. Y'all never, ever stop trolling. Y'all don't go to work. Y'all sit at home all day on YouTube, all day on the phone, Calling and tape recording people. This is what y'all do all day and night. I'm just over here cleaning out my closet. Okay, you know what? And see, that's the problem I have with you on site, April. Me and you were supposed to be way tighter than you and Mona. But you let lying ass Mona I ain't never lied to you, April. And, 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 and Mona kind of gave you no recording of me talking about you. I know that's a damn lie. I know that's a goddamn lie. I did call you. I've been calling you. But instead of you answering my calls, you all in everybody chat. So I'm knowing you got your phone. See, I don't have time for that. I did call you. I wouldn't even be on this live if I didn't call you. How you? Listen, you can play whatever you want to play. I never talk crap about you. And you're going to listen to Mona the liar? First of all, you shouldn't even be in between this. You're a subscriber. Mona is a content creator. Why are you and Mona communicating about me? And you, you are being very disrespectful. See, I like, to nip I like to nip stuff in the bud. You did not answer the phone, April. You could have told me this. You call me for everything else. You text me for everything else. But now I'm on this live making this. Now I could get your attention. Now I got your attention. Why you didn't call me yesterday, April? Why you didn't call me back the day before yesterday, April? I text you this morning. You didn't call me this morning either, April. And then now I'm on the live. And now here you are. On the live. See, this is why you can't call me no more. You can't call me no more because you're too messy. You're too messy. You should never be in between me and my business on my channel. It's not. It has absolutely nothing to do with you. Nothing. I'm not doing none of this mess. I'm not. I'm not. Can't nobody use me as no pawn. Can't nobody control what I say and do. Y'all want to do this shit behind the scenes and play these games. I'm not doing it. And then y'all want to do all this shit behind the scenes. And then as soon as I try to contact you behind the scenes, you don't respond. But then when I go live, here you go. Where were you all them days? You yesterday for the ponytail challenge. Oh, I know. You made it plain you weren't going to be over here. You went over there to Rita. That's cool. But I talk to you almost every day on the phone, though. See, that's that fake ass shit I don't like. That's that shit I don't like. I'm a grown ass woman. I'm grown, y'all. I don't have time to play. And I do mess, but I'm not dirty. I said I like mess, but I don't like dirt. I don't do dirty. And that was dirty of you, April, because we I've been riding with you from day one. I've been riding with you too from day one. That's mess. And if Mona gave you a recording, all you had to do was call me. We could have talked about it. Me and you, me and April have gotten into it before. We could have talked about it. But hell, I can't talk to your damn voicemail. So I'm going to come on here and talk to the 656 other people that will talk back to me. You know what, April? So you can say I didn't call you. That's a bold-faced lie. I don't have anything to prove because I could put it on my community tab showing. So I didn't text you this morning either before I came live. I didn't text you before I went live either. And if that's the case, why you didn't reach out to me then? You the one said you had something against me. That was your opportunity to reach out to me. And I did reach out to you. That's the problem. You decided not to answer. And Mona lied. Mona tried to conquer and divide because she's a hater. And you fell for it. 
You talk to me every day about anything else. Has Mona ever given you anything? But that's who you listen to? They not holding nothing over my head. I've been told them, release whatever y'all want to release. You're going to see they sound crazy. And what's disturbing about it is you fell for it. Is you fell for it. You believe anything she say. It's so, it's, it make me feel like you wanted to believe that. If that's all it took for you to just stop talking to me because I'm Mona and I'll probably a lie she told. No, she didn't lie, but it wasn't that bad. So if it wasn't, let's get to this. If it wasn't that bad, why did you stop talking to me then? See, that, that, that doesn't even make sense to me. It doesn't make sense. D is some not clean in the, in the milk? April, you was, okay, you know what? You was at your family reunion, but you could talk at everybody else's chat and be there for everybody else to probably return everybody else's call. I bet you made time to call other content creators this weekend. See, if I am misunderstanding our relationship and all it takes is for some first, you're not talking to me because somebody sent you a tape. Now you say the tape wasn't that bad. Now you was at your family reunion. I, 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 I can't. I, like, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. What's, I don't know. This is what I know. All this behind the scenes stuff, I don't want any more parts of it. I am aware, April, that you have recorded me. I don't want any more parts of that. I have had to record you because I became that I became aware that you were recording me. So we're going to put it all out there. Just like you were recording me, April, I had to start recording you. Because you always like to call me and have three, four, five people on the phone and sometimes just one person on the phone and I don't even know they on there. And I told you, I always think I'm being recorded. And because of that, I have been recording. So we're not going to play the recording game because we could have a recording YouTube for the next three weeks on here and I can make a old nasty piece of coin off the recordings. But see, this is why I don't want no more parts of this mess. Okay, nobody, ca don't call me. I don't want to talk to anybody but my mod. Don't worry, April, I'm not lying and I'm going to prove to Sean that I'm not lying, okay? See, once again, you're saying I'm lying and I'm not. You're saying I'm lying. Oh, you don't want Sean to know that you had me on the phone with and you recorded him and, well, that you were, that you called him when I was on the phone if I'm if I tell Sean the exact conversation, April, he's gonna know I'm not lying. So why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? See, this is why we need to just stop it. Just stop. Just stop. Sean will know for a fact I'm not lying. Now I know you're trying to cover yourself, but Sean will know for a fact I'm not lying. Cause how the hell I know the whole damn conversation verbatim? Now I may be a prophet, but doggone. See, people start shit and then can't finish it. I'm gonna finish it. I'm gonna finish it. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to finish it. Because, see, I see the spirit that these people from TSCC, they all act alike. They troll. They do behind-the-scenes crazy stuff. They reach out to this one and reach out to that one. You, you over here trying to run your channel, and they reaching out to all your people. Why? Leave my damn subscribers alone. Why? Yeah, this is the school of TSCC. They come with this division spirit. Oh, they very jealous hearted. Very jealous hearted. Ooh. And don't none of them like gay men. None of them. Mark my lips. None of them. Let me tell you something. Some of their, some of their hope to belong somewhere is so much stronger than their hatred for gay men. So they run up behind Sean, even though they ain't crazy about gay men, they'll still run up behind Sean, but they don't really like gay men for real. Don't none of the TSCC members care for gay men. Trust. Current or ex. Trust me. Don't play with me. Why else would y'all, what else would y'all have in coming over there with that damn demon? Five babe, could y'all ever see me over there? Huh? Could you ever see me over there? It takes a special type of demon to kick it over there around there with the TSCC. Special type of demon. April. Just let me run my channel, honey. Do You can do whatever you, you do you. I'm just going to run my channel the way the Lord lays it on my heart to run it. And it is what it is. I'm a queen, honey, and I'm standing on my own. And I'm cleaning out my closet. I'm getting all the bullshit out of my closet because from this day forward, ain't nobody going to be able to say they got a damn thing. So go ahead and release everything y'all got. And while y'all releasing, I'll be over here releasing so we can all just take a long shit together. Wouldn't that be nice? 
Everybody just ought to release it, baby. Let's take a long one together. Because guess who deserves the truth? I deserve the truth. Sean Bradley deserves the truth. And really, that's... Oh, Teresa deserves the truth. And really, that's it. Mona, a whole lie. She don't deserve a damn thing. Corny is a fraud. She don't deserve a damn thing. Okay? And this is why I never open my... This is why I never open myself up to a bunch of them ex-TSCC members. No nonsense. Amazing Grace. Chopper. They all are mad at me because I would talk to April and wouldn't talk to them. And no, I wouldn't. No, I wouldn't. Because y'all ex -TSCC and I don't trust y'all. Because y'all was down with the shits. So, when Sean made Kwani HBIC, and when Sean said, because they take this HBIC stuff very seriously, child. When Sean said, um, April, I mean, uh, Kwani going to be the HBIC, and maybe even for 2020, immediately, April got on her job, child. Immediately. She didn't like it. She didn't like it. Mm -mm. She said, I'm going to make Sean cancel Kwani. See, it's manipulation. It's control. It's subscribers trying to run um, somebody else's platform. That's what it is. Subscribers. And this is why I, don't, I, don't, I ain't talking to nobody else. I what in the hell is going on on these motherfucking streets? What's going on on these streets, people? These motherfuckers is exposing and revealing themselves and baby. Okay. So, yes, I am aware of the video that Five A made. I'm watching it all today. I just want to see what these motherfuckers got going on. I will say this. If anyone has been recording anyone, release the recordings. Release the recordings. All these people hollering about, I got this, I got this. Let us hear it. Thank you, Lace Queen. Let us hear it. Why is all of this secrecy behind closed doors mess? What's going on? Let us hear it. If, 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 if I hear one more person say, I got receipts, and they don't drop no motherfucking receipts, I'm so Let us hear the shit. I'm so sick of the I got receipts. Well, drop the motherfucking receipts already. Now, yeah, not one iota. Y'all already picking sides and every damn thing. And I find it quite interesting. I find it quite interesting because I'm like, hmm. If you only knew. And the thing is, I know some things. I don't know all things, but I know all things when it pertains to me. <laughs> yeah, cool, cool, cool. They sound like deranged lunatics. Like, oh my God, like these people are, it, it would be scary if it wasn't laughable. It would be scary if it wasn't laughable. Deranged lunatics. Like, like I really think these people need to go out and get a life of their own. They need to go get a life of their own. I mean... Really, they do. Like, do they not go on vacation? Do they not go out and um and do things? Um, I mean, they really do need to go get a life of their own. Yeah, the obsession is real. I mean, do I need to bottle up my sweat or my blood or, or like like the flakes on my skin, and like my dead skin cells, and sell them? Because this shit is creepy. I don't think it's me. Um, I th I'm humble enough to know that it's not me. I think it's Club Chat. And they see the power of club chat. Um, D said, why would anybody want to be with people who don't want them or places they are not invited to? Um, yeah, I don't know. Um, but I think they um, they want the power that is club chat. I don't control club chat. You guys control club chat. But they think I control club chat. And I'm like, I don't. They don't really understand that. I don't control club chat. They want that power. Like, um, I think, you know, the fact that um, if I say, hey, guys, let's, um, I'm, I'm going to support somebody or whatever. And if y'all decide to go over there and support that person and love them with super chats, um, they want that power. And I'm like, I don't control what people do with their money. Like, Club Chat controls what they do with their money. You know, it might be a person I want to get some money today. Y'all might be like, nah, we ain't giving that bitch no money. And a lot of them hold it up there are bitches that wouldn't get money from Club Chat. Um, yeah. Um. <laughs> I'm jealous of a super chat. You really need to get your mind right. I wear sweaters that cost more than what a super chat gonna get you. Okay? Don't play with me. My sweaters are $80. $70. So don't play, don't play, don't, don't play y'all stuff on here. And I got a whole nigga. Okay? So that type of stuff right there, that's petty. And that's where, that's what, how y'all think. I don't think like that. That's why they call me Five Day, because I came out a motherfucking firecracker. I sure did. Listen, y'all think I don't play on here? I don't play in my real life either. This ain't no damn joke. I didn't tell y'all one lie this morning, and I didn't tell y'all one lie this afternoon. I don't have to lie to you niggas. Really? Girl, these folks think I'm pressed about a cash app and about some super
Super Chats? No, I'm not. I said it earlier and I'm going to say it again. I don't want club chat to support me that way. No. Don't come over here and give me nothing talking about you giving it to me in the name of some damn club chat. You are a subscriber on YouTube. You are not owned by Sean Bradley and Club Chat. So if you give me something, it needs to come from you, subscriber, you, onlooker, not from no damn Club Chat. That's not what I desire, okay? And I work and own my own business, okay? And my own property. So please cut this out about this Super Chat mess. Please, just stop that. Please, just stop. Just stop. Once again, that's some old let's pick Fight Babe and Rita against each other, and it's not gonna work because every time a video comes out about Fight Babe, guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna come right over here and respond because it's my right and I exercise.